Now, News 18 Sports. We're about halfway through conference play in boys hockey, and four teams in the BRC are all within two points of each other. Memorial there in first undefeated, but Hudson, Chi High North, they're right behind with just one loss. Could get even crazier after tonight as the Old Aves and Huskies clash in round one of the city battle and buckle your seatbelts. First period, Memorial strikes first. Carter Autumn cleans up the trash out front. It's one nothing. But later in the period, Huskies on the power play. Right place, right time for Caden Sutter. We're all tied at one. Then the second period, all fun. Old Dave's man advantage and Autumn redirects for the sh his second goal, giving him the lead, but North answers. Sutter there to clean it up for another. We're all knotted up at two. Autumn, though, says we can't have that on the rush. The clapper from the right circle lights the lamp. Give him the hat trick, but... Hold on a sec. Here comes the Huskies again. Off the rebound. Tyler Albright with the goal. 3-3 heading into the third. And Memorial brought the pressure to start the period. Are you kidding me? Autumn again. His fourth of the night. That gives him the lead. So last chance for North. Under 10 seconds left. Extra skater. Tommy Ward is finds the back of the net. Ties it at four to go to overtime. Nothing going on though in the extra 10 minutes. Yeah, I know. What a game though, but it ends in a tie 4-4, the final score. Woof, other conference action. The Cards hosting the Wildcats. No score in the first, but Chai High pressuring Jack Bovey from the corner. Right through the keeper's legs for the lead. Then a couple minutes after that, back in Wildcats territory, Isaac Lindstrom to Isaac Frenette who sneaks it in. They're up by a pair and they just kept scoring in the first. Nick Carlson gonna send it to net. Cleaned up by Lindstrom for another. They score four in the opening period and four more after that as they get the shutout eight to nothing. How about some middle border action? Ram hosting Somerset, scoreless in the first. Ram though staying aggressive. Cade Struck attempts the backhand, but Kayla Bentz makes the save. Then later in the period, the visitors now on the attack. Jeffrey Anger gonna send it between the goaltender's legs for the goal. They're on the board first, but Ram has an answer. Just moments later, Ray Marzinski with the snipe. That's gonna tie the game up at one, but all Somerset after that, they score the next four goals and get the win on the road. Let's go to the girls' side where the top-ranked ECA Stars are coming off their first loss of the season. No time to hang their heads, though, with a tough trip to central Wisconsin tonight. No, oh, by the way, the Storm, they're ranked number two in the state. It's the battle of the state's best. We'll go right to the second period and check out Naomi Stowe with the save to keep it scoreless. But the Storm on the attack again, but Stowe, she stands strong. But this time it's the Stars. Cameron Cormody to Sydney Weiland though is going to make the save. Moments later she can get tested again, but we still are scoreless. But on the other end, it's Audrey Laidwig going to lead the Chargers. Shot is blocked, but Lauren Ellis there for the rebound. And the Stars drop their second game in a row. 4-1 the final score. 